Hey, this is James from Roland, and I'm at Sam Ash with the new EC10M Cajon Mic Processor. It's a very, very cool product from Roland. Uh, now we have a microphone and a processing unit specifically designed to work with any Cajon on the market. So the product comes with a condenser microphone and the EC10 module, and it has 16 built-in kits for uh, expandability and to expand your sound on the Cajon. A really nice thing about this processor is that not only does it have built-in sounds, but it also has a looper. So if you need uh, to have a loop function or if you want to just lay down a groove, you can do that on the EC10M. Here's the microphone for the EC10M. Again, it's a condenser microphone, and the clip just clips right onto the back into the sound port, plug into the EC10 module, and you're good to go designed to work with any Cajon on the market. Okay, on the unit itself, we have 16 different kits built into the module. So you have uh, one sound for your, your wolf tone or your bass tone, and one sound for the slap tone. And again, the module itself uh, detects the frequency and triggers based on the frequency. So there's no actual trigger in the Cajon, it's just a microphone. On the module itself, you have a volume knob for the microphone and a volume knob for the electronic sound. So you can mix in how much of your acoustic cajon sound you want or how much of the electronic sounds coming from the EC10M. You can easily mix in and dial in your sound. You also have a compressor on the microphone. You also have a threshold knob to adjust how much of the high frequency sound the, uh, the slap tone and the wolf tone coming out into front of the house. The module also has big uh, backlit A and B buttons so you can scroll through all the different sounds just by tapping with your foot. And to audition some of the sounds, I'll just play a little bit and uh, you can get a feel for what's built into the module. We also have a looper function built into the EC10M. You just hit the mode select button until it flashes red and then hit the B button to arm the loop. Now as soon as I start playing, it's going to start looping. So right when it detects the first frequency, you're good to go. And then when you want to stop it, just hit the B button again. So now it's going to loop over and over. And if I want to audition a bunch of the different samples, I can keep the loop going and change out the sounds. To stop, I just hit the B button again, and if I want to roll the loop, I just press B again. To clear the loop, hit A, and I'm ready to start over again just by pressing the B button. Very, very simple, but very, very cool to have a looper built in. The EC10M also has a pad function, so when I hit the mode or select button and the AB buttons turn green, then I have certain pads that I can use like I'm, I'm, I'm hitting a foot pedal. So here on, on this kit number, um, the B button is a clave sound, so I can just use that if I want to um, play quarter notes or keep time. Very simple. And that's the EC10M by Roland. If you have any more questions, go down to your local Sam Ash music store or check out samashmusic.com.